Hello everyone and welcome to Jumperman Tech where we specialize in HVAC but do everything DIY and today I want to show you how to check a three-phase compressor to ground as well as how to check the windings. Thank you to everyone tuning into Jumperman Tech and to begin our lesson we're going to remove the three wires from the compressor's terminals. Luckily this is a molded plug where we could just pull it right out and that's it here are our three terminals we're going to begin by checking this compressor for a ground and before we do we're gonna find a copper surface and I'm just gonna take a little bit of sandpaper and sand it down so we have a nice clean surface the pipe is now sanded down we're gonna set our meter to ohms. And we're gonna check each terminal to ground. From each terminal to ground, we should be reading OL, which is open line. So for one terminal to ground, there is no resistance. We're reading OL, that's good. Next, we're gonna take our next terminal, Let's touch that to ground. Open line, that's good. Next, we're gonna take or not our last terminal and check that to ground. And we are reading open line. That means there is no continuity from the terminals to ground. That means our compressor is not grounded and it is good. If you don't wanna use resistance, you could also check continuity, which has an audible sound. Setting our meter to continuity is just another method of checking resistance, except with an audible sound. So we're gonna take our two leads, ground them out, so we know we're good. If we have a ground, our leads are working. And we're good. So if we took our line from each terminal to ground, if you would check and you would hear an audible sound, that means you are grounded. Next, we can check the resistance between our windings. So we're gonna set our meter to ohms. Here's our light. And we're gonna check across the three terminals. So let's start with any two. Between these two, keep it on there, we have a reading of 0.67. Now between the next two, we have a reading of 0.67. And now between the last two, we have a reading of, still changing, 0.67 and the windings for this compressor are good you're supposed to be reading the same resistance between any three terminals of any which way that you touch them there's also no grounds here this compressor checks out and we're good and that's pretty much it if anybody found this video interesting or helpful please drop a like comment and subscribe catch you all next time Thank you.